Hi there and welcome. I guess you are keen to try our customer engagement automation platform and learn how it can help you. In this tutorial, I will take you through how to create the segments. Creating segments is the way to group and classify users based on certain characteristics or traits that you can define. For example, you might create a segment for users who have made a purchase in the past 30 days or for users who have visited your website 10 or more times. Segments allow you to filter through customers, understand different trends or patterns among them, and divide into different groups of people. It's crucial to note that individual users can be added or removed manually from a segment. You can only define the rules that determine which users are included in the segment. So, to create a segment, you need to navigate to the sidebar and click the segment page. On this page, you can create new segments and review existing ones. To create a segment, click on the Create button. A segment is set of filters, the setting of which determine which customers fall into a particular segment. Press Add Filter to add the first filter to your segment. Select from this list either a linear attribute, array, event or aggregate based on which you would like to build your query. To add more queries, you just press the Add Filter. Choose either OR or AND operator to set dependencies between queries. OR means that customers that match at least one of these queries will be segmented. Click on the Customer Sample tab to review the segment group of customers. To save the created segment, press the Save button on the top right corner. Here is an example of how you might use segments to filter a group of customers. Let's say you want to create a segment for customers who have made a purchase in the past six months from the category Beauty and Health. To do this, you would add one filter with two subfilters to your segment. So as we can see, we have 562 customers who had made at least one purchase for the last nine months. And the second event filter would be category beauty and health. So we are choosing the category field that equals beauty and health. By setting the operator matches all, you will create a segment of users who have met both of these criteria. So, I hope this video was helpful to you. Comment below, like, share and subscribe if you enjoyed this tutorial. Look forward to seeing you!